Hello everyone, welcome to my channel Plantastic Mail. Today, as promised, I will show you how to make spring rolls, Thai spring rolls. There are many variations out there. I want to show you one to lose weight, so there will be no avocado, no other nice stuff. It's still gonna be very delicious and it's gonna help you to have some nice snacks in between or a nice light dinner. Uh, we are starting here with different greens. I have mixed greens, spring greens, arugula, and some red salad. Uh, we have red onions, um, carrots, and I like to grate them this way. So I have the special knife here and I will link it um, for you. It's available on Amazon and it's very cheap. And then we also have, um, I have um, tamari sauce. You can do soy sauce or any kind so of first soy I'm sauce adding some wasabi to the wasabi. tamari sauce. I usually and use not more than that paper. because wasabi is very spicy, but whatever you guys prefer uh, is fine. And mix it up usually with a little of Make sure that the wasabi is completely dissolved, otherwise somebody will have a very spicy experience during this dinner. And then you can put this aside so that this can rest for a little bit. And next I'm using the rice paper. If you never worked with rice paper before, it feels like plastic. It's pretty stiff. And in order to get it soft, to be able to roll it up and eat, um, you have to soak it in water, ideally in warm water. Uh, so use a plate or a bowl that has approximately the size of your rice paper to make it easy. And I like to rotate it because I'm always holding one end and um, to make sure that all the areas are soft and soaked, I'm rotating the rice paper, always holding it. If you lose it, you use a knife to lift it up because it's very slippery. And you can feel that the rice paper is getting softer and softer. And at one point, it's gonna be almost like a fabric. And that's the time when you pull it out of the water. It's usually a few seconds. Like I can already feel it's getting soft. And in a moment, I'm gonna take it out. Yes, there you go. It's gonna again feel like a sheet. And then you just get rid of excessive water and place it on a nice flat plate. Uh, be careful, the rice paper tends to act like those um, plastics that stick to itself. And now I start rolling it up by filling it with some carrots. Always work on the closest end, the closest third of the rice paper to you. Put some onions on there, some red salad, and you can have tons of varieties. I will give you more videos. I will post more videos in the future with different varieties. You could do bell peppers or corn or whatever you like. Uh, again, just be mindful. I know avocado tastes great on spring rolls, but in this case, we want to avoid that. That's about it. Always avoid the sides because the sides will be folded in in order to close the roll. So now you saw I took a knife and I was lifting up the rice paper. I'm holding it here with my two thumbs on this end, pressing all the content towards me and starting to roll it up. And after the first turn of the roll, I'm starting to fold in the sides to close the roll on the side and then continue rolling always very tight. I try to roll it up nice and tight. Okay, this is a very nice spring roll, a little skinny, but we take it. And then what I like to do is I like to cut it diagonal, like so that you have a very nice cut and it's easier to dip
I hope you enjoyed this video. Thank you for joining me today and I see you next time. Bye!